Hey friends, it's Lisa finally back with a new process video. Um, today I'm sharing my first design or for first project for We Are Memory Keepers in the new American Crafts Design team. I got the new glue quill to try out and it's amazing. <laughs> You couldn't see a lot there in the beginning of the video, but um, it's just uh, like like doing a regular cut file, like cutting a regular cut file, but instead of cutting, you have the glue pen that traces your design and then leaves the sticky design on your page, and then you can use uh, the glitter on top. So I used gold glitter, and um, then I used my watercolors to paint the whole design. And I, the, when when the thing was done and I put the glitter on it, I was like, I was amazed. I, I would not have never thought that the design would be so perfect and so like really good and this, the stickiness is really good because you can see it's a big design so the machine was doing its job for probably half an hour and the glue was still sticky everywhere so that's amazing um yeah it's uh, it's really cool and you should really really try it out i i really love it i was like i said it was just so cool to use it and i uh, was amazed I was like wow this is great uh, and you can also use it with embossing powder so you will trace your lines with the sticky glue uh, with the sticky pen uh, or the glue pen and then you put your embossing powder on top and just melt it or yeah I don't know what you call that but uh, yeah and then you use your heat gun on top and that's also very cool. So yeah, you can you can do a whole lot of things with this. It's very cool. So I, I've um, cut my flowers out and used them on this amazing, amazingly beautiful uh, watercolor page from the Bloom Street collection from Paige Evans. And then I wanted to use a really cool summer photo and uh, I was I was looking for the placement of the flowers. I wasn't really sure how to do it, but yeah, uh, I wanted to use this picture from um, a few weeks ago when I invited friends over, and I thought that it would um, it was really matching. Oops, sorry, <laughs> it was really matching with the with the colors. And the assignment also was to make a summer layout. So um, I think I chose uh, the right uh, cut file and the right photo. And by the way, this cut file is from Paige Evans. So if you go to the Silhouette shop, you can find this, this um, cut file. And it's a regular cut file. Uh, you can use the, um, the glue quill with regular cut files. So no need to look for special designs and things. It's just like the regular cut file that I used here. Uh, and I will try and remember to put the link down below from the cut file so you can just click on it and find it if you want it, want to find it. And yeah, I matted my photo with some vellum and then uh, I wanted to have some transparent leaves but not white. So I painted the vellum with um, some green color and put some splatters on it and then I cut my I cut my, my leaves out from this and I think it looks very cool. Um, yeah, it, it gives like this different texture and design and it's, yeah it's it's very cool <clears throat> and the vellum it warps a lot when you put water on it so uh, yeah it has this really this really really cool texture and then I use my my uh, thickers uh, I think they are Amy Tangerine and 
Hmm, the pink ones I don't really remember, but they're all from American Crafts. And I used some butterflies from the Maggie Holmes collection. Oh yeah, I think the rest of all the stickers are Maggie Holmes. <clears throat> the latest Maggie Holmes. So yeah, guys, that's it. Uh, you should really, really get into this and try the glue quill because it's, it's amazing. Let me tell you, I loved it. Okay, so thank you so, so, so much for watching and being here and see you very soon. Bye-bye.